Hey guys, Kevin here. What I've got here is an accessory kit for my GoPro. This has got a lot of different things that I can use to get the most out of this exciting little camera. Now this is designed for the GoPro Hero 5 or 6, but it'll work with the whole GoPro range. It'll work with any action camera really, if it uses the GoPro system of, you know, attachments. Now, this is sold by shoot, but you will find that these accessories are available by a number of different companies. It's really just generic items being packaged in a different way by many different companies on Amazon and eBay. The reason I went for this one, well, it, there was a lot of other kits that had more items, 50 items, 60 items. This only had the things that I thought I wanted, that I didn't think I needed all the extra things that other ones were giving. Plus, the selfie stick in this one looked a little bit better than the one that was being offered with uh, different kits. So it cost me £18.99 and the number of items on this, well, it's it's pretty mad. I'm, I'm not going to go through them all, but there's a list there. Camera belt, head belt, surface mounts, wrist belts, the lot. There's a lot of things there. So let's get this open and we'll see what it's like. Okay, everything is contained within the box. Uh, and you can get ones that are just only with a bag. I think this comes with a bag as well. But I love the idea of having everything so that, you know, everything in a case so that... Oh, I'm opening it the right way or the wrong way. Um, I love the idea of having it all in a case just so that it becomes a little bit easier to manage everything. You know, when I pick up different accessories, I can keep it all in this beautiful case. Okay, so what have we got here? There's a lot to get through here. So I'll just go through it one by one. Now, obviously, I'm not going to be spending a lot of time testing these out. That will happen over the next couple of weeks or the next month. But I'm just going to show you all the items and then it'll give you a better idea of whether this kit is something you'd be looking for. First thing, selfie stick. Now, this is the one that I thought looked a lot better than other ones in the market. And the other one was the kind of generic one you get really cheap. This one, it looks really well made at the bottom. You can see it there, um, you know, kind of metal fix at the bottom. Really good uh, tie at the bottom to, uh, you know, wrist strap. That looks, feels really good. Kind of looks like it. this is designed for the water as well. Um, but if that's as far as it goes, then, then it's very short. Um, this is actually quite a mixed bag, this particular item, because I think that the grip's quite good. It looks like it's good in water. The wrist strap's really good, but if you look at the actual pole, it seems very short, but it also seems very cheaply made. So, you know what, I've got, this is the one from Blitzwolf, it seems a little bit more solid, and it's longer, much longer. And this is my Benro one, which is the kind of the, the original style, that's even longer than those. Maybe, I don't know if I'm maybe, if there's something wrong here, if that's the only... If that's the only uh, length of it, then it's a little bit disappointing. Feels quite, it feels okay. It's branded with the shoot brand, but I would say the actual pole feels cheap. But, you know, it's just part of a package. I do have other selfie sticks, and monopods, etc. Anyway, it's not a deal breaker. And, you know, just for something thrown around the pool, this should be okay. God, where do you even start with all this? <laughs> I'll try and get the bigger things out of the way if possible. Um, this is, I don't know what you would call this, a, fl a floaty, a floating device. And the, the idea with this is when you, you can use this attachment and you can, you know, you can attach it, um, where's the actual shell here? I'm going to show you an example. I really should have been prepared for this. Um, I'm looking for the, oh, there it is. <laughs> there it is. There. So, um, the housing, the housing we go in like that. You could host it like this. And the, Id the idea is that when you go into the pool, whilst this is waterproof, it will sink. This will bob along. It will float. And, you know, if you're if you're taking shots and recordings in the pool with your kids, if, you know, on holiday, something like this would be really cool because you can not only hold it, but it means that you don't have to worry about the action camera actually sinking. So that's really useful if you're going on holiday or you need to take any shots in the water. There's so many things, I don't even know where to start here. Two down, many things to go. Right, this could be the head strap. Yeah, there's a head strap. I'm 
seems okay. I mean, it's just fabric. Um, and then you've got the GoPro attachment there, which, you know, you'll see a different range of attachments that you can put to this, like the different buckles, J buckles and all this kind of thing. That looks good. Um, I can't think of any way that, you know, any reason to use that just now. But that's the whole point of this kit, is that when there's a, like a bizarre recording situation, I'll come to my magical GoPro box and I'll find some way to do it. Um, I think that was for... No. Okay. Um, <laughs> right, okay. This is a really cheap tripod. Um, and you know why I know it's cheap? It's because I've got a couple of them already. <laughs> these are really cheap. I, I got these a long time ago. You see, I've got a hot shoe in this one. I got these a long time ago uh, from China for like less than a dollar. They're, they're not the best, to be honest. They're quite cheap. But if you just want to sit, you know, if you just want to sit your action camera down for a second, they're not too bad, but you can't put any weight on that really. Very, very basic. So not something I care about. Um, okay. Now, I will apologise. I am clearly not going to get the names of all these things right. You know, it, I've got the list there to refer to, but I'm not sure if I'll get the names right. So this is something that I think will be very, very, very useful. So, the idea of this one, well, it's quite simple. Uh, crocodile clip. You can strap this to, for example, your bag strap. Put it to your bag strap. You could put it to anything, really. This will attach to a desk. It'll attach... This thing's fairly well made, actually. This is quite... That's got a lot of tension in it. That's quite thick. I like that. That's something I think I'm going to get a lot of use out of. I don't know what they call that, actually. What are they calling that? Um, as I said, there was a few other accessory kits, and these things had... These kits had, like, 50, 60 different items. And I honestly didn't think I would get used for most of them. Okay, this was something that I really wanted to get. And it looks a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. This is the suction cup for your car. So you can put in a lot of different uh, attachments there. You can see that, that's, that's basically just a tripod, just a, a general tripod extension. Kind of feels cheap, to be honest, this one. I mean, they're all plastic, but this one doesn't... Feels like this could break easily. Yeah, it's not the, the strongest. Um, this is something I wanted so that I can do recordings whilst I'm driving, uh, especially when I get at the, you know when I put my external mic to it uh, on top of the camera, I get better audio because the audio on this sucks. Um, this would be good. Idea being, let me do it like that. Kind of a funny angle there. Don't know if that's something you can swivel around. Um, if that, no, it doesn't look... Oh, right, right, okay. I could do that. So, that tightens it up. Really, the real test with this will be how well it sucks. You can see it's a little bit squashed there already. Um, I've went through so many of these, um, you know, suction cups, etc. for your phone. If you check my channel, you'll see a lot of them, but I've done lots of reviews of these kind of suction cup things. Um, lots of them. And in general, 95% of them suck. They're all really, really bad. Um, but hopefully this one's okay. If it's not, I might actually go out and get a, a better one. One that will stand the test of time. Oh, well. Test of time as far as any accessory would. So there's a, a pouch here as well. That's quite good because... You know, there'll be times when you don't want to take the full big case. Well, those are just inserts, so you can put other things in there. Uh, there'll be times when you don't want to take the big case and, you know, just want to throw a few accessories in. Or perhaps when you're going to the beach. Bags always come in handy. Okay, what else we got here? I'm getting through it, bit by bit. Right, that is a mega bag. Right, we've got some, uh, what do you call that, the adhesive pads. Uh, we've got some pads there, and that's to do, you know, a lot of sticking with the other things that are here. I'll bring these out. 
That's the thing. It was eighteen pounds ninety nine, but you, you do get a lot of value for money because if you buy a lot of these things separately, you know, it'd probably two or three times the cost. So, um, yeah, there's that many things. I'm kind of losing my train of thought. This looks like the chest strap. The idea is you strap this around you. Same idea as as the head strap. So instead of your head, it goes around your, your thin or fat body and you put your camera there. So there will be times that will be quite useful. Um, for example, if I do a hill walk, I could strap this to me, get some footage. And that's when you can maybe set up things like time-lapse video, time-lapse photos and things like that as well. Perhaps if I was running, I could set it up. Not sure, but something else to have there, you know. Again, that's what I say. This this is why I wanted a accessory kit. There's only a few of these items I think I'll maybe need over the next couple of weeks. But in the future, there's going to be a lot of things that I think, oh, that'll, that'll come in handy. So, I've tested all those. Um, and here you've got some adhesive pads. And you've got some, well, some of these will be, let me see, they all look quite similar. These are the kind of things that you would stick to your helmet. You can, of course, stick them to any surface. Um, there's four of them there. That's good because you will end up using some of them over time. Maybe losing some of them. I'm just going to keep everything in the bag just now because if not, it will be chaos for me trying to work out which ones I've looked at and which ones I haven't looked at. As I said, you know, if you're looking at other accessory kits, you will find that most of these items are in 95% of them. Um, okay, this looks quite good as well. This is the wrist belt, I believe. So, the idea being, if I can get this open... I assume this is what it's for. You would put it on like that. Obviously, I've not put it on correctly just now, but that's the idea. You put it on and you could record like that, like some sort of action hero. Yeah, that could be useful as well. Longest video ever. Right, so... This is, you know, down, we're down to the nitty gritty here. This is all the the components. Now, you've probably seen a lot of these things, um, like the, the straps, etc., that look like it wasn't complete. This is where these things come in. And, in fact, I'll do that with that one. So... Try to get through them all. There is what looks like a, what would you call this? Uh, a curly mount, curved surface mount. There's a little surface, a basic one. That's, I've got that on, I've got that on top. This is the same one I've got on top of this selfie stick. Um, In fact, I had it somewhere else. I had it there. That's that's the one I've got sitting there as well. Um. There's lots and variations. This looks like one that goes to the head strap or something. There's a few of them. There's, God, there's ones for everywhere. This one, I know, this one is for your handlebars. So this is for going on your bike. So there is a lot there, guys. Um, you know, time will tell whether this turns out to be uh, a fantastic setup or not. This um, case here, the, the, this part, the rubber part here, can actually be taken out quite easily. There's inserts here that I can remove. You know, if I want to take these out, I can, like that. Those look for very specific things. I'll leave them in just now. So there'll be a lot of things I can put in, in that part. And, you know, I'll, I'll package it up and I'll try and get this a little bit more organized. And then I'll show you how I would set this up. So I've kind of just packaged everything back into it and I put the head strap, the the chest strap, the wrist strap up here with the pads. I've got the selfie stick tripods, the little floating device and all the different accessories down here. If I was going to use this on a regular basis and I was taking it with me, depending on the equipment I wanted to take with me, I'd maybe take this foam insert out. 
maybe take it out and, you know, just to give me more room because there's a lot of wasted space here. It does help organise things a little bit, but, you know, some of these things are kind of pointless for the size of them. I mean, look at the size of them. I don't know. Um, it's, it's fantastic the amount of accessories that they have included in this. And as normal, as you would expect, you know, when you, when you put these things in, it's a little bit bulkier than when it was packed in at the factory. But all in all, I think this is a, a good little kit. You can get these kits ranging from around 10 to maybe about £30, $30. And I've opened it upside down. <laughs> I am really that stupid. I literally just turned it around and I didn't realise I was opening it the wrong way. That's how stupid... Oh, it's been a long day. It's been a long day. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. This has been the Shoot Accessory Kit. I picked it up for £18.99. Um, this was one of the reasons because it had a, a better selfie stick. Better handle, but the actual selfie stick is short and... Maybe a little bit disappointing. It's okay though. And overall I'm pleased with it. Uh, time will tell how long these last. I'll, I'll, I'll be trying out the selfie stick. I'll be trying out the, um, the chest strap and the head strap etc. Over time. But not over the next few days. Maybe over the next few weeks. But overall I'm fairly pleased with it. Looks like a good kit. And you will find that 90%, 99% even of all the kits on Amazon, they've all got the exact same items. They're all produced in the same factory in China. So even though this one has been produced by Shoot, chances are the one that you're looking at on Amazon, on eBay or whatever, has the exact same items. Thanks for watching, guys. If you've got any questions about this, please do let me know in the comment area below. And until next time, take care.